Hey y'all, it's Cindy. I got a package this morning. Got a package. <clears throat> hey Ziff, how are you? Hi Vida. So look at this. Huge package. We're going to open it and go through it. I paid $23.99. It was $16.99 and then uh, $8 shipping. So it was $23.99. Let me just make sure I tell you what it said. It said, Vintage Estate, Modern Jewelry Lot, 40 Pieces, Necklaces, Bracelets, Earrings. So, but in the pictures that the gal showed, she showed rings too. So we shall see. So let's, let's get going. So, I liked the colors on this lot. So, those are pretty. They're just plastic. But they're nice. I like them very well. I like those. There is, let me just pull it out. This big piece right here is what kind of caught my eye about the whole lot. It's just, I mean, it's just plastic, but it's freaking awesome. Let me get it up. There we go. Get that. Oops. Don't let me come undone, but that's not a huge thing. I can undo it. I can put it back. Yeah, I can put it back. Anyway, so look. Isn't that pretty? That's definitely a statement. I shall be putting that on Poshmark. So, um, beads and wooden pieces with a Giraffe and a zebra. Not sure how I feel about that one. <laughs> uh, a zebra striped cross. Hey, San Juana, Betty, Peterson, uh, Kathleen. Welcome, guys. So, you know somebody who likes beads? Thanks. My Walmart special top. So clearance off of the Walmart. So that's cool. Those are glass. So. Looky here at this little guy. I remember seeing him. Uh, Try to make sure. The lady that sent this, that bought this, don't live too far from me. So, it does have a tag on it. It says, what does it say? Where's my little eyeball? There it is. Hey, Mary. Welcome. XC. I don't recognize that, but I love this guy right here. Isn't he adorable? Look at that. So that's that side. That side is not so adorable. This side right here is the side I like. Look at that one. That's the side I like. He is cool. So, so anyway, I love the little elephant. Him is precious. Let's see if we can get this big old cuff out of there. Big cuff. I'm finding hairs. <laughs> we all know how Cindy feels about hair. Okay, that hurts. And these stretched. There. There we go. Maybe. I'm not going to do it. Ow. It hurts. There we go. Anyway, just a nice metal cuff. Ooh, this is pretty and it feels yeah these are stone pieces and let's see it's got a hangy tag i'm gonna guess lane bryant that's what i thought lane bryant uses these really long tags for their jewelry and uh the reason i know that is i found two lane bryant pieces from that i brought from my booth that i know where i bought them but these are These are stone. These are stone, and these feel like glass. These are little stone chips. 
Very nice. A very nice necklace. Definitely worthy of posh. Definitely. Ooh, that's cute. So, that is really nice. So. And I have some things to show y'all from yesterday. Looky there. Okay, obviously, this is like the wild animal lot because we've had zebras, giraffes, elephants, and now we have all I want for Christmas is a hippopotamus. I'm singing to the wrong tune. I was started singing all I want for Christmas is a my two front teeth, but that's the hippopotamus song. I always like the hippopotamus song. So anyway, that's cool. Look at that. Okay, I'm sorry, but that is amazing. That was one of the things. I love when things just catch my eye. Look. First of all, I'm not a horsey person, but look at those horses. How can you not like that? That is so cute. Metal is showing some wear, but I think that's awesome enough to sell with that even metal wear. Who likes the horses? Hey, Shelly, upstairs, downstairs. Welcome. Do you like the horse bracelet? Isn't it cute? Oh, that's a real bamboo bracelet. Wow, that's cool. It's wooden. Uh, yeah. You like those horses? Aren't they cute? That is, as my mama says, that is you, girl. That is yeah woohoo a weapon <laughs> the, those are pretty i love the colors on that i may have to keep that i like that oh wow okay i thought it was two and one but it's not let's see if that that's really nicely made but i don't see no name in it but it's got a uh, what do they call that? The hair. Where they dye the hair and use it in the... In the... Y'all know what I'm talking about? The hair? Ooh, I like that. Yeah, I like that real well. And look at this copper-toned one. That's cool, too. It's just copper tone. You can see there's metal loss there. Oh, that's those are pretty beads. You are teaching me to like beads better. Those are pretty beads. Yeah, this is an uh oh. This is a natural slot. That's a leather bracelet with a pretty little elephant on him. He's cute. That's a nice necklace too. I like those copper colored beads. Hey Des, how are you? Hey Perla. Hey Boosh. How are you? This is an eBay lot that I bought. So, I paid $16.99 plus $8 shipping for this. Okay, this right here is why I bought the whole lot. <laughs> and it's going to be, yeah, hold on. Is it going to be anything? It's TC925 Mexico. And... It says $6 on the inside. Of, uh, it has a tag that has a $6 price, but it has turquoise inlay in it. Very cool. It will be getting tested for silver this afternoon. Very nice. Very, very nice ring. Let's see if I can get closer so you can see it. Come on. Focus, focus. Focus. There you go. There you go. Isn't that neat? So I really like that. Y'all know I love rings. Let's see. This one here is kind of cute. Let's see. Does he say anything inside of him? Uh, has a number on it that is obviously probably. Yeah, it's cute, but it's nothing. It's, but it, I mean, I shouldn't say it's nothing. I'm sorry, little ring. I didn't mean to hurt your feelings. I'm talking to it. <laughs> but it's a stackable kind of ring. Like that. Now, this one here might be another little silver ring. No, it's not. Yeah, she only had it marked a dollar, so no. But it's cute. Little. Come on. There you go. 
Got a little blue stone in it. So, obviously, this lady had a booth somewhere. That's a nice little. That's stone, guys. You could hurt somebody with that. I can hit myself in the head with that. Hurt myself. So, yeah, pretty nice jewelry. I'm very well pleased that I got sterling silver out of it. And uh, I just paid $23.99 for it. So, look at this. Now, okay. Y'all know I like this. Lay that to the side. Look at that. That is really cool. I really like that. The beadwork is nice on that. Let's see. Ooh, I like that. Look at that. Very, very nice. Look it. Give it a thumbs up. Okay. These here will go down to my booth on the dollar board. They're just little plastic. Yeah. Hey, Anamora. How are you, hon? Oh, another thing for the dollar board. But you know what? That's a big old bracelet. Here, I have big hands. Pull this out. But I bet I can get my hand in that. Oh, yeah. That can go all the way up to my elbow almost. <laughs> well, not quite. That was a bit of an exaggeration. Hmm, I don't think I'll wear it, but yeah. So, this is a brand new set. It was originally marked $7.99. That's kind of cool. They're, they're definitely plastic. It says E-L-E-V-E -E -E with an accent mark over the V. So, it's made in China. I may take that over to my booth at Waldron. After, after I look up what that what that is. So, this says Paris Collection. That can go in my free gift box or it can go to my booth. Clamper. Zebra Clamper. As I start emptying out. Hey, Peyton. How are you, hon? So, anyway. Okay, here we go. We've got a bunch of... Brand new stuff. Oh my gosh. Ain't he cute? It's a butterfly. Looky there. Ain't he cute? And those are cool earrings that are my birthstone. And those are cool earrings. Those will go in my, my free gift box. You know, the box that I dig through when I send you guys presents. I, I mean, when I send you guys jewelry. You buy from me, I give you free gifts. I have a box that I free gift out of. So look at this ring, guys. Okay. I saw this ring. I know it's not anything, but I like it. It's square. I've always been a square person trying to fit into a round hole. So round square peg trying to fit into a round hole. So there we go. Very cool. Very cool. So. Put my ring back on. That is a Mojave turquoise. Mojave Desert turquoise. Uh, that came from Shop LC. So y'all know I like my Shop LC. Somebody got me hooked on it. We ain't gonna name no names. But her name starts with a V. Ends with an A and has an ED in between all of it. So, if y'all can figure it out. <laughs> okay, guys. This is another really cool necklace. Now, I was hoping there would be a name on it. Look at that. That looks like snake skin to me. No, doesn't that look like snake skin? But it's all metal. That is absolutely amazeballs. To quote a famous Jimmy or Carla, that is cool. I like that. Does anybody else like that? Maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm just weird. <sighs> okay. Another 
animal print necklace. And oh my gosh, I've been reading fashion magazines and they say that it's going out of style. Oh, well, I can sell it here. We're always in what a little ways behind the style here in Arkansas. That is uh, just a little stone bead necklace. You know what this would be good for if you're into aromatherapy? You could drop your oils on this and uh, make it. I bet it would absorb. I bet many. Oh, it has a matching bracelet. And we're down to the last piece. So that's cool, too. I mean, there ain't nothing real about it, but it's, I love the colors. So, love, love, love the colors. So, anyway, that's neat. So, I would say for $23.99, I got a good lot because I did get silver in it. So, and that was my hope. I, I could see that ring and I, I was hoping it was silver. We'll test it and make sure, but it looks and feels like silver. So, anyway, so this was a good, good, uh, good uh person to buy from on ebay she had quite a few lots i'll tell you what her ebay username is it was baby yes i am wearing my gumball earrings it was her her username was baby 22 b-a-b-y 22 so i want to talk about to you about some things that i've showed you already uh so guys i don't know if you wonder into this and this is a, i'm going to totally give honor give honor where honor to do give credit where credit is due is the word i need to use but um do you get some of those big old honking hoop earrings that are that have the stud on them my friend vita gave me this idea look see that one it was a big old earring i took my snips and cut off the stud thing i took a file and filed it down so it don't hurt me and stretched it just a little bit and it makes a cool bracelet super cool and it's not that i don't have enough bracelets without wearing earrings on my ears it's just i love bling and that was just too blingy to leave in the to leave in the thing so Anyway, so that was a Vita ideal. Vita, Vita, if y'all don't know this, Vita makes beautiful jewelry. Beautiful jewelry. And in fact, I'm working with her on an ideal. We're going to, I'm going to open another Etsy store. I mentioned this a little bit of this the other day. And um, um, it's going to be called Funky Fri Frippery. I need to go ahead and set it up before somebody gets my name at, since I've mentioned it. Anyway, but okay. Boo will remember this. Look, Booge, I finally found something to go over that. It was an earring. So I fixed those. Look at those beads. Aren't they amazing? They're so cool. So, hey, Flippin, how are you? So, hey, Lynn B, how are you? So, it is a good idea. It's a cool idea. Oh, do y'all want to see, do y'all want to see the owl after I fixed his little eyes? I gave him some new eyes. He turned out really nice. Look, he's, his little eyes are pretty and sparkling now, and there's two of them. So, cool, cool, cool. Very cool. So, we're going to, I'm going to show y'all one more thing that is, um, that I talked about. So, you remember this necklace right here? So, thanks to the help of my friend Peyton. Peyton, Peyton. There she is. She found the designer of this person, of this necklace. And this was made by a company called Galleria Luc L.A. Lacano. Galleria Lacano. These are, they call these pre-Columbian reproduction beads. So, they're a reproduction of a very old piece and while if they if they were real and really old they um would uh, be worth big bucks like i would call somebody and be freaked out but they still can sell for a good price i i've been researching this company and their things sell for good prices so uh thank you so much for sending those to me robin if you're in here today so anyway but that is a really cool company so and uh these are made out of stones 
um, agate and I'm trying to think what the other one was. I can't remember what the other one was. Agate and something else. I'll have to um, think about that. So anyway, so that is really cool. So is Ro is Robin in here? Robin, the, I have, there's too many Robins. I have a bunch of Robins, but it is an awesome necklace. It is an awesome necklace. Now I have to be brave enough to list it. Y'all know I'm a little paranoid about listing things that can bring good prices. So anyway, so just a little paranoid. Just a little. Y'all, last night when I went to bed, I had my desk cleaned off and now it's loaded back up again. So I've been making jewelry bags for the next auction that I do. And this one is cool. It has things in it that you don't expect. Look. Look at this little thing that's in this jewelry bag. I know it's not jewelry, but isn't that beautiful? It's a this is totally pliable, plasticky, rubbery rose rose, but then it pops off. There's still perfume in it. It doesn't smell bad. It don't smell good, but I'm not a perfume wearer, so but the bottle is adorbs. It's too cute. There's um, sign pieces. There's all kinds of stuff in that. There's a nice watch in there. So some vintage pieces. Anyway, that's going for the next auction that I do. So you anyway, have really, and I've been working on a craft bag too. So uh, anywho, yeah. This one here is a big craft bag I've been working on. So, except for I need to take out these right here because I need them for Sunday. Because Sunday is St. Patty's Day. And these are uh, Mardi Gras beads. Oh, you know what? I might need to go back through this. This may not be the craft bag after all. I thought that was a crafting jar that I had started, but I'm seeing things in there that might not be crafting stuff. So, I'm on on and look through what I'm doing here. I'm not on a note. Anyway, so, I'm working on my first cup of coffee. My hair is crazy today. I mean, like, crazy, crazy. Anybody's name start with a T? Got a T necklace that fell out of that. But I need these for St. Patty's Day to wear to Children's Church. So, because kids like things like that you know and um, I'm just weird enough to do it there tell me I didn't lose yep I've lost something I had a brooch laying over here that I was saving back to wear too and I've lost it I'll have to get in the corner and dig so anyway hey Ronnie Virginia Gardner Shelly oh I said how do you all go uh, so I don't know if it's passion perfume or not. It didn't have a name on it. I don't know. It was just a pretty little perfume bottle. Um, <laughs> I brought it from my booth and I had it in a grab bag at my booth and I was looking through the grab bags and I noticed that in that grab bag was a, what did I do with it? was a compact and I wanted to bring the compact home and see what the compact was <laughs> so anyway so I brought it home y'all I'm turning into a hoarding old lady so there's that compact there's that compact there's this little pill compact 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 Compact. I don't know the word. That's a hard word. So, hey, Susan Gill. Welcome, darling. So, anyway. And now I can't find the one that I brought that home for. What the crap did I do with it? Yeah, I just need a housewife. I wonder if I can find a housewife. Anybody want to be my housewife? There are no fringe benefits, I'll tell you that. <laughs> so.
I know, I'm a ding dong. So, what is it about little collecty things that I end up with? I end up with these little collecty things and uh, just just stuff. So, you want a housewife too? So, you'll come be my housewife. So, anyway. Dave probably wants a housewife. He probably wants somebody who will clean his house. I could, y'all. I, I'll just tell y'all this. I'm not I'm not ashamed to admit anything because I know y'all are my friends and y'all love me. I'm not a good housekeeper. I'm not. In fact, I can my my house can get down right nasty. So this is a little Avon thing. It has this, it has a little angel necklace, and it has a little birth stone, a little pink stone on it, and it all fits down in this little angel and uh she's uh yeah it all fits down in this little angel and she goes together like that so it all goes down in there and she goes together like that and i feel like i'm not got her there there and then that goes down in there isn't that cute so anyway i should see your coffee table look here's the deal why clean house when there's jewelry to play with? Used to, it for me, it used to be why clean house when there were books to read. But now my attention span is so non-existent. I can't hardly pay attention enough to read a book. I do good to pay attention enough to do videos. And some days I don't even do good doing it. <laughs> just, that's just how it is. So this necklace, y'all like this necklace right here? It's an Emmons. Didn't even know I had it. And I put it on and wore it one day and turned it over. And it says Emmons on it. So, I just, I just, yeah. Anyway, so, but, yeah. You know, why, why clean house when there's a jewelry to play with? There's books to read. Or there's something to listen to on YouTube. I love to listen to things on YouTube. I will put up screens and work and listen in the background. So, you want what on a t-shirt? What do you want on a t-shirt? You should see my coffee table. You clean one room while your kids... See, I, mm, okay. My kid is grown. He's home again, but he's grown. But uh, he's not bad. But my my darling, darling husband, uh, before he got ill, was like nitpicky. This is awkward. October simulated tourmaline. It is made in 2002. So if I wait just two more years, I can put this on Etsy. That's okay. It'll probably be here in two more years. So, so why clean when you can be going through jewelry? There, that goes. Yeah, that we need to tell Margaret she needs to make us a T-shirt like that. So, anyway, Patty messaged. Okay, okay. Anyway, so um. But, yeah, before Dave got sick, he was like a neat freak, big time. And after he got sick, the man is a slob. I mean, like, seriously, a slob. And that bothers me more than anything. And I'm and I'm a slob. So, this morning, though, when I went into my kitchen, I was like, I don't want to eat food that comes from this kitchen. I'm like, this would be one of... Gordon, if Gordon Ramsay showed at my door, he would yell and cuss and say bad, bad words to me. And y'all, I never liked Gordon Ramsay until my son come home and we watched this thing on YouTube. Um, I don't know what it's called, but we watched this thing on YouTube where he goes to restaurants and saves them, or we go, he goes to motels, hotels, and saves them. And oh, I'm like stinking hooked. Man, I wonder what that came out of. That's a cool earring. I wonder what it came from. What is that show called? Does anybody know what that show's called? Is that uh, Kitchen Hell? Is that what it is? That is neat. I got to find the other one to that. That is neat. Did that come from something you sent me, Boosh? So. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. And I still ain't found that little compact. Okay. And my leaning tire of jewelry keeps wanting to slide off its base. So I'm going to have to figure out a new base for it. So, but 
here's what I did last night. I did get some things done last night. This box right here is all of this is for me to take pictures to put on Etsy. All of that stuff. This stuff right here is all vintage jewelry that can go on no Poshmark Etsy. <laughs> so I have work here to do. I just have to do it. Just have to get motivated. Motivated, motivated. Oh, and this right here. But I wanted to show y'all the other thing and I can't find it. Hey, Vanessa Haran. How are you, honey? So, anyway, uh, Vanessa showed up right as I'm fixing to tell y'all bye because I'm just fiddle faddling. Kitchen nightmares. Thank you, Vita. Thank you. So, yeah, my kitchen was definitely a nightmare this morning. So, so I'm fixing to go. Uh, you can watch the replay. I showed some jewelry that I had fixed. I showed some jewelry that I'd showed earlier. I also showed a lot that I bought. So, anyway, but my kitchen is not a nightmare no more. I cleaned it this morning. Now, I have to go to the Walmart. And, yes, I call it the Walmart because I'm an old lady. But I have to go to the Walmart and pick up prescriptions. But I also need some milk. And I declared I'm not going to the grocery store this week. Because if I go to the grocery store, I buy junk I don't need. Junk food, junk. And I don't need it. So I'm going to get some milk at Walmart. Because I won't buy groceries at Walmart. I have a thing against the groceries from Walmart. <laughs> well, the meat section, that's my... Y'all, I... If y'all took me to a psychologist, he would tell me, I'm sorry, I can't treat her. She's beyond help. She's a nut. So, anyway. So, thanks, guys. Thanks for joining y'all. Thanks for joining my program and what, coming watching me live. Thumbs up, everybody. If you're not subscribed, subscribe to this madness that, that everybody calls Cindy. So, anyway, I was given some of my email, email this afternoon, and he's like, I spelt it out for him, and it was like, C N D and he's like C N C as something N as Nancy B as boy and I said no D as David and I was like sound it out C N D Cindy <laughs> Cindy <laughs> so he's like wow that's cool and I was like well that's not what it was intended for it's supposed to be C Cindy and Dave so anyway so later taters Thanks for watching. Have an awesome, awesome weekend. Buy some cool things. Make videos and show me so I can live vicariously through you. Remember, I bought this from uh, eBay user B Baby22. If you want to go check out her lots, they're great. I also have a lot coming from um, Robin and Chip that I bought on their channel. So I left the link on the description on it yesterday. So be sure and visit. Have a good and great weekend, guys. Bye. I love y'all.